In this problem, we've moved on from complementary angles to supplementary angles. The process is essentially the same, only we know that their measures add up to 180 degrees instead of 90 degrees. So let's assign some variables. I went ahead and drew a picture here so we could see uh, the scenario. It's two supplementary angles. The, their measures, the sum of their measures is 180 degrees. They form a straight line when they're put together. That's another way of looking at it. So let A equal the measure of the first angle. Let B the measure of the second angle. And what are we looking for? We're looking for the measures of both angles. So what do we know? We know the two angles are supplementary. Well, that means the sum of their measures is 180 degrees. So we know that A plus B equals 180. We also know the measure of the larger angle is 12 degrees more than three times the measure of the smaller angle. So we're going with A as our lar larger angle, so we know the measure of the larger angle, so A equals 12 degrees more than 3 times the smaller angle, so 3 times B, the small measure of the smaller angle, plus 12. So here's our system of equations. A plus B equals 180, A equals 3B plus 12, so with this, since we've already solved for A in our second equation, we're going to use substitution. So substitute what A is in the second equation into the first equation in terms of B. So 3B plus 12 plus B equals 180. Simplifying, we get 4B plus 12 equals 180. Subtract 12 from both sides, we get 4B equals 168. Divide both sides by 4, and we get B equals 42 degrees. So now, as usual, our second step is substitute, or our next step. It's technically not second step, but our next step is substitute b equals 42 in order to solve for a and you can use either equation I'm going to use both so a plus b equals 180 and we solved for b as 42 so we substitute that in a plus 42 equals 180 Subtract 42 from both sides, and we get A equals 138 degrees. Now let's use our second equation to verify A equals 3B plus 12. So that equals 3 times 42. plus 12. So 3 times 42, that's 126, plus 12, which equals 138 degrees. So again, tentatively, the measures of the angles are 42 degrees and 138 degrees. So let's check this. We do that by plugging it into both of our original equations. So A plus B equals 180. So we want to know does 138 plus 42 equal 180, 
and it does indeed 180 equals 180 so it checks there in our second equation we have a equals 3b plus 12 so we want to know does 138 equal 3 times 42 plus 12 so does 138 equal 3 times 42 is 126 plus 12 and we do end up with 138 equals 138 which checks our solution so the measures of the angles are indeed 42 degrees and 138 degrees.